There's so many different focal lengths out there. Which lens should you buy? Which focal length should you use? Well, the 85 millimeter is my favorite and I'll tell you why. Eighty five millimeter along with the fifty and thirty five millimeter are very popular focal lengths amongst family and portrait photographers. But whenever somebody books me, I'm always bringing my eighty five with me. The eighty five millimeter lens that I use is the Sony eighty five one point eight. I've had it for many years and I absolutely love it. It's a very fast lens being f 1.8 and it's actually a really good size too. It's really sharp and I've never had a problem with it. I do mostly family and portrait shoots and the 85 and the 85 millimeter has a really flattering look. It's almost like it gives your face like a slimmer look. It has really good shallow depth of field so there's a good distinction between your subject and the background. It's absolutely amazing for close-up shots. I think it really makes the subject stand out. So when you're on a photo shoot, you can just concentrate on your photo shoot and not worry so much about the background. And I think this lens has great compression. Some of you may be wondering, what's lens compression? Well, lens compression is where the subject and the background, where they appear closer than they do in real life. Something to note with the 85 millimeter though, this may be a pro or a con. You have to stand further away from your subject than you do with, say, a 50 or a 35. This could be a con because you may not have that much room where you can move around, and some may look at it as a pro where you're not so much in your client's face and they can be a little more comfortable and act more natural. The combination of standing further away from your subject and using a telephoto lens, it gives the viewer the impression that your subject is actually larger than it actually is in real life. And therefore this gives the appearance of the background being pulled in closer to the subject. If I only have one subject that I'm shooting, I generally shoot with an aperture of 1.8. This gives great bokeh and I think it makes portraits look amazing. All of these shots I took with my 85 millimeter and my client absolutely loved the photos. You can see how she just pops out from the background and it's a very flattering look. I do hope to upgrade this lens in the future to the Sony G Master f1.4, but I just haven't found a need for it yet. This lens has been great. Some other great uses for this lens is food photography. It's gonna make the background really creamy so your food stands out. And it's also really good for street photography. Like I said before, you have to be further away from your subject so you're not so much in their face and you can get some great shots. I hope you liked this video and found it useful. If you did, please give my video a like and don't forget, hit that subscribe button. As always, thank you for watching.